Margo, you are my purest motivation. How you love and care for your friends and family inspires me to do the same. Ever since we met, you've become my greatest role model in life. You are a beacon of light that always makes me happier, as you're the reason I don't get homesick anymore, because you are my home. Well, I am so happy to finally be standing here with you exchanging our vows. I've known from the very beginning that what we would have together would be special and life-changing. I love you more than I can begin to say in these vows. From the little things to the big things, I love how you've always stepped up to be the partner that I needed. And I equally love the playful side of you that makes up spontaneous songs about your day and chases Bo around our dining room table until you both pass out on the couch. I love how closely you listen and how you surprise me months later by remembering the smallest but most meaningful details of our dates and conversations. You've given me all the confidence in the world since we met. It has never been more easy or clear to put someone else's needs and wants before my own. I will never stop getting better for you. I love how you always push us both to be the best versions of ourselves no matter what. And when doing that meant me moving across the country for grad school, you were the first and loudest voice saying do this and don't look back. That time apart only deepened and enriched my love for you. And the thought of the life that we would have together when I moved back here made me feel more centered, more secure, and more motivated than I could ever have imagined. And I promise, promise, to love you unconditionally, to always remember the feeling of this moment marrying you right now, and to cherish the experience of sharing with you everything that life has to offer us. Whatever comes in front of us, I will be able to smile through because I have you by my side. I do and will love you forever as long as we both shall live. I love you well, and I'm yours now and forever to love, to hold, and to cherish in sickness and in health, for better or for worse, as long as we both shall live. about where we are. We're up in the mountains, 8,300 feet in the air, and half of us are from two time zones away. But if we look around, this is home. This is home. Will wandered out to this state and built this home, and he met Margo. Margo is the center of my world, and I wanted to be with her doing what she was doing all the time. I don't have a big circle of gal pals, and it's probably because Margot's every best friend I ever needed. They say that the art of marriage is forming a circle of love that gathers in the whole family, and Margot gives that energy to any group of people she touches. Down here in the sea of love, where everyone would love to drown, that's a favorite line of mine from a Fleetwood Mac song. As we all wish, Margo and Will, that you float around in that sea of love for a very, very long time. We love you.